Welcome back to the High Sierra Report. As promised, joined by Sherry McConkey. Now, Sherry, how did everything go this weekend? It was a, an amazing weekend. Everything turned out perfectly. I don't think it could have been any better than this weekend. All the hard planning obviously paid off. Now, the Chinese downhill, we got the results from you. Rylan McDuff, first place. Conrad Snover, second. Matt Jackson, third. And then for the women, Jamie Burge, first. Shauna Hogan, second. Wendy Murphy, third. Shout out to them. How were their costumes? They were amazing. I, I mean, they, it's always quite shocking to see that these people can come out dressed on the snow like that and uh, how much work goes into all their costume planning and everything. It's, it's, it was nonstop laughter, side splitting laughter. Oh, man, I wish I got to see it in person because yeah. it got moved to Sunday because of the winds and yeah. uh, some snow came through. I guess that helped, you were saying? Yes, it was incredible. The conditions were perfect and it, uh, the skies opened up and... It was beautiful out, and, and Squaw Valley was raging with tons of people. It was super fun, and it was great um, people watching, you know. It was great to watch the competition, and it was a super fun day. How was the Snowblade Ballet? That was amazing. We had some great judges. Troy Coddell, who's one of the ex, um, ex-Olympic champions in, snowblade, in snow, no, ski ballet, and he was a judge, and, and, and Mike Powell from K2 is a hilarious guy. He was commentating, and the, the call-outs were just incredible and funny. We lost <laughs> nonstop. I can't wait to see the pictures. Where can people find them? So they, they're coming up. They're going to be posted online at shaneMcConkey.org, and they'll also be on the Shane McConkey Foundation web, uh, Facebook page. And um, they'll be coming up throughout the day. So just be patient. They, they'll, they'll be posted online as soon as possible. And absolutely, you know, you just did a wonderful job at the gala. I want to give you a shout out, and I want you to deliver the line that you closed your speech with because it was absolutely amazing. Okay, well, it's not any thanks to me. It's all my incredible friends, but we have one line.